Easy people. What's going on here? This ain't the Akai Force. This is outrageous. <laughs> no, what it is, is I just wanted to clear something up. Um, on a previous video about this, this time, I said um, about the 305 and the update and told a few folks to, yeah, you should get uh, Ableton Live Lite because it's free. But, and uh, also Scalar. And I want to make, I want to clear that up. You don't have to get them. You don't need them. It's free. If you have a computer, get them. But you don't need them to work with the Akai Falls. The Akai Falls is, is ace now. You can do absolutely everything with it. The only advantage what I say, was saying, and I'm, I'm showing this now, is because I've got a tune here. And um, it's got some really sophisticated warping on. And like little editing things and that lot. And it's not that you can't do them on the Akai Force. It's just that it would take a considerable amount of time, especially this thing, what I've done here. Now, everybody doesn't, for starters anyway, I'll say this for note. The way I use warp, I've not seen anybody on any video use it the way I use warp. Because I do something, I, I use it to create rhythms. And I haven't seen that. I've seen people mess around with what, but I haven't really seen anybody do what I do. I, 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 I'm, I'm not saying it's good or bad. I'm just saying it is the truth. Now, that's one example. The real example of why I give that is because I do do warping um, and, and sometimes I do it for flattening, but sometimes I do it to change the rhythms of something. And because I do that, you can do that on the Akai Force, but it takes ages and I, I wouldn't be able to show you in real time how you do that in, on a video. And if I sh showed you on an edit video, I don't know, maybe I'll do an edit video to show you how you do well. But it's long. And I just think of if you're going to do certain things, they're going to take so long that you might not even be interested by the time you do it. So that's number one for why I said that about Label Life because of the way I work. Number two with the scaler is just speed. Certain things like... I've got a scaler here now and I can just go quickly here and I, I go, all right, um, I'm going to do these chords here. So let's say, I, let's say I'll clear this um, somewhere here. Right, well, let's just clear this, um, remove them. Right, say I say to myself, right, uh, right, uh, I don't know, I'm not going to think about it, but I, I'll use this. Say, I'm, all right, I like that, that's one. I like that, that one. I like, I like that. Right, that's it. Bob's my uncle. I've got that there. I can use my ears. I don't ha That's just lightning fast. Then maybe I go, right. I like that, but I wouldn't mind that inverted. See, I can invert that. These are things what you can't do on the. You would have to. You would have to kind of get into it. You can do it. It just wouldn't be as fast as I just did that. So again, that's another example. Um, if you have a computer, if you again, if you don't have a computer, then don't worry about it. Don't go buy one. You're all right. It's not, if you haven't got a computer, you're not coming coming across these things. The second thing is MIDI importing. But again, with MIDI importing, um, I think you need a computer. I don't know, I would assume you do. But MIDI importing, it, it's easy with this. Why? Because all I have to do is put my MIDI into an Ableton Live Lite program and that file is read on the archive force so anything that can go into Ableton Lite is imp is now instantly compatible with the archive force so that's the only reason why I said that and again it's horses for courses I sometimes like I said I like to do this stuff where I'll go right let me try to find a key of that and I might say well I might do this tune really quick. Second thing is, and I'll, I've, I've not stated this, but every, nearly every video I've done, all of them tunes I'm making there and then. Sometimes, I, 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 I think I've done 100 and something videos. I think I've only saved two songs. 
because I'll just show them as demonstrations and then I just delete them. I don't even save them. What I've been starting to think about is I might try to see if I can upload the projects so that people can have them as projects to as starter projects to work on. You might ask me, why do I do this? And I just go, why not? Look, the world's falling to pieces, pandemic, everything's just changed. So I'm just trying to share what I've got because you're only here so long, why not? So I hope that's cleared up that issue. Um, and what I'm gonna do, this tune, what's been cool is I've been going through a lot of these tunes because I've got tons of tunes on Ableton, tons, and I've just like left them there. So now I'm gonna import it and maybe do a remix on, on this thing. Um, I'll play it, I'll play a bit. So. So this this song has got a world of instruments going on and that lot. So it'll be interesting to see how these pick up in uh, the Akai Force. So so just um, what was it? What did I call it? Book bookcases end bookcase. Anyway, to wrap this up, basically, no, you do not need um, a a computer, b able to live light and c scaler to to use the Akai Force. If you have a computer, Able and Light, Live Light is free. Um, Scalar 2 is 40 quid and it's worth buying. If you don't have a computer, you're laughing. This machine is ace. I wouldn't be championing it if it wasn't ace. The speed that and versatility that you can work with on an Akai Force, I, am, I, don't, I can't think of anything what compares to it. In my personal opinion, definitely for a standalone, there's nothing close to this because there's so much inspiration and so many different ways you can tackle a problem. The, the thing what I say is it is similar to Ableton because Ableton is the same way. There's so many different ways you can attack a problem. The difference is because it's so hand on and so fast to work with, me personally, this beats Ableton hands down for speed and, and like versatility and flexibility. L little kind of scalpel stuff that's where um, a computer comes in. Little kind of micro scalper, scalpeling, little things where this would probably take 10 minutes where it'll take, I don't know, two seconds on, on a computer to do. And that's the difference, just time. And that's, that's just the truth with technology anyway. It's just time. So you can do all this stuff on a phone. So, but again, it's how long it's gonna take you to do on a phone and would you wanna do music on a phone? So. Yeah, so hopefully that's been helpful. And um, any questions, just say like and subscribe and um, I'll catch you back on the Akai Force. And until then, as always, peace. <laughs>